Him from Super Radio. Oh, yes, Super Radio. Yeah. Um, give, us all, give us all the background of Dirty Deeds. Where you from? Where you at? How you been? I am from the DMV, born and raised in the DMV. Um, Super Radio is a nonprofit community internet radio station that highlights urban life and culture um, in the DMV and beyond. When? Uh, how long have you? How long have you been doing? I've been doing Super Radio. I've been Sorry. doing Super Radio, the actual internet radio station, since 2020. But I've been doing media since 2006. So I've done okay. TV. I've done radio. Um, I had a couple of blogs and everything, kind of focusing on DC hip hop, DC culture. Um, it kind of branched off into sports and news and different stuff. Let me cool. ask you a uh, question. What do you feel like having done, having that history with media and working through all of those? Obviously, like what, what has changed the most, but what do you feel like is still kind of like the same when it comes to in media or in hip hop? In media, in media. Um, or, or access. In Why not both? Well, from a media standpoint, it's the access to media. Um, obviously, okay. through internet, through social media you can find almost any kind of platform you want any anybody talking about anything and everything um and people having such an easy so easy for people to start right and get into quote unquote media. everybody's not media but i'll just say quote unquote media. um what stayed the same is um just aspect of media general just kind of just speaking on what's going on um in the world, in the community, things of that nature. That's all that's going to be the same. Now, how'd you get into uh, radio, internet radio? I got into internet radio through a friend of mine. Um, his name was DJ Cash Money. <laughs> Rest <laughs> in peace to DJ Cash Money. He passed away from COVID last year. Oh. Um, he had an internet radio station. He actually worked on um, PGC and KYS mm. as a DJ. Yeah. Um, he decided he wanted to do his own platform because those platforms wasn't promoting DC hip hop enough. Yeah. Um, so he used he got his own platform, his own internet radio. Um, and I joined him doing on air stuff and started doing behind the scenes kind of management promotion stuff. And through him, I learned how to establish my own internet radio platform. I like that. Now, I mean, what do you use exactly for internet radio? Like, is there a platform? Is there? I have a website. You do your website? Yeah, um, superradiodmv.com is a website. You can go um, and check out. Um, it's usually music streaming Monday through Friday from 12 to 10, but right now I'm kind of re reworking the aesthetics of everything. So you can go on in, you can listen to music, um, you can go in and you check out content, you can check out podcasts, you can check out um, different videos about what's going on in sports, what's going on in entertainment, what's going on in the news, um, all is in kind of one place. Is the music content DMV heavy? It's a mix. It's, it's a mix? Okay. It's, it's not DMV heavy because I have yet to find enough DMV hip hop to feature DMV hip hop as much as I want to. Enough good DMV hip hop. Uh, thank you. I, I, I hear what you're saying. There's a lot of DMV hip hop, just not like when I when you listen to Super Radio, I always tell any artist I've worked with, your music should be able to fit within the industry music and people not know that you're independent. They should be able to listen to Jay Z, hear you, and listen to. Cardi B and your music should be on the same quality on the same level if you want to get on the radio. So if you I can't have a drop off in my in my music because right. just because you're from DC you get a spot. Don't right. no, that makes sense. That makes sense. Excellent. Cool. Uh, I wish we had graphics we could throw up so that we could I know. I was trying to is this Wait, we can go back in and edit them in. Oh, um, super S U P A. I was gonna super see. Radio. That's that's why. That's why uh, I wanted. I, I wish we had graphics so we could actually see it spelled out. Super. S U P A. Super radio. Um, are you guys on radio. Instagram? We are same thing. Super Radio DMV on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Um, yeah, that's about it. That's what I got right now. I'm trying so to do super a TikTok. Super Radio. What is it? DMV. All one word. So I'm trying to get into the TikTok thing and get super big into TikTok, but uh, yes, ma'am. <laughs> I have some people do some fancy TikTok dances with Super Radio TikTok <laughs> once I learn how to do it. 
That's the website. Uh, of course, you know Flex, Mr. Yep. Matthews. He's one of mm -hmm. our favorites. Flex, when I've been watching Flex rap since I got into the whole hip hop scene. Um, he didn't have gray hair in his beard when I first met him. <laughs> <laughs> that was the first thing I noticed when I seen Flex. Like, wow, we got gray hair in our beards now. Oh, we didn't no. have that. We didn't have that when we first started linking together. <laughs> so, are you gonna be here for the rest of the evening? Um, unfortunately, no. I'm. With, um, I did a presentation earlier on um, getting take, getting the most out of media. Uh -huh. um, oh, you did that. Yes. Oh, you're right media now. mayhem. Um, so I'm gonna get up out of here and go take care of some other business uh, in a little um, bit. So I just want to stop through and say hi and show my love. I seen you all on YouTube. I was looking for DC content to feature on the website and came across. Uh, yep, came across DC. Miss you can use it anytime you want. Yeah, that's all I needed to know. That's uh, the only thing that I haven't used it because I wanted to make sure I was. That's fair. Yeah. Uh, well, so one of the, another podcast that we produce, it's a hip hop podcast. They're gonna be here like in an hour, like. An hour and a half. In an hour and a half. Oh, okay. um, Which was they called? They're called Grande Life. So oh, two okay. of the three of them. So Artemis. Artemis. Ah, and, uh, Artemis. And yeah, he didn't um, have gray hair when I met him either. He still don't have gray hair. <laughs> he still doesn't have gray hair. He's a lucky guy. <laughs> Some of it. Yeah, yeah so be, the, two of the three of them will be here to, gotcha. tonight. Well, I wish I could stay. Yeah. At least say what's up. Yeah. No, well, we'll let them know you said hi. The DC hip hop scene is his. Those who was in the DC hip hop scene when I started back in 2008 have evolved into other aspects of local hip-hop um, radio and, and media and things of that nature management um so it's good to see him still involved right. in uh -huh. he's in a knee deep yeah 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 grindstone's a friend of ours as well and pinky yeah yeah pinky killer corn yeah killer corn corn killer corn yeah, i've done a, what's up joey yeah i've, I've drank a right lot now. of tequila with pinky <laughs> a lot of fun. that's one of my favorite songs Oh, dude, that was our theme song for our our, for our original show was DC as fuck show. Uh -huh. Tequila was our theme show. song. Wow. And, that is... Yeah, because me and Pinky used to hang out like every Tuesday for like four years. That's what's up. Yeah. That's what's up. Huh? Yeah. The second music. Oh, really? Huh. Nay, hey, Nick. He said the, the email wasn't working. Submit. Sorry, we got a Joey from the Amphibians talking to us. Right so, yeah, <laughs> back to you since you're here. <laughs> Let me turn her microphone off. Um, yeah, man, they're all that's all great shit. I like that because I mean, that's something I, I eventually want to do down the road is the internet radio. So, anytime there's people doing something like that, I fucking love it. It's very easy. I come to find that when I did my research i found out it's very easy to set it up um yeah it's very difficult to maintain if you don't have i'm doing it all by myself like you said mate our shows are two out two to three hours long mm -hmm. we can fill up a lot of time oh yeah my show when I, I usually do my shows one reason why i do have my own platform is to make sure i can do content when i want to do content and exactly. some days it's an hour show some days it's a four hour show i think one day i went for six hours we did a one four hour show but that was because we were high on <laughs> That's always helpful. We were like, "Fuck, are we still recording?" Yes, we are. Okay, cool. But no, like, like I said, more to walk to use any of our stuff. It's, I mean, we got hundreds of episodes, so feel free. We'll do stuff out. Like definitely I said, make sure two to three hours of content can fill up a lot of space yeah. <laughs> for you. So we definitely um want to get some District of Misfits show on Super Radio. So if anybody um you miss it on YouTube, or if you want to catch it within the midst of everything else on Super Radio. Either way, check them out, support them. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And then Super Radio, let me show the flyer. Boom. Super Radio, DMV. Oh, you should listen. That's actually an old flyer. That was an old flyer. Well, that's what she said. Yeah. yeah, I used to do a radio show on um, WIA 96.7 FM oh, in Arlington. Um, I'm planning, I might be going back. Well, I actually plan on doing some more content over there in Arlington um, in 2023. Um, so look out for that as well. Thank you all. Appreciate you, man. You're welcome. Like I said, hit us up if you need anything. Will do.